always happen. Hi, I'm Nick Shell, the internet receding hairline guy. Today, what are we going to talk about? Well, you know that cliche about how money can't buy happiness? And you know, here's the thing. Here's the same way. I mean, here I've... I haven't had a shaved head since last December, so I mean, how many months is that? Eight? Going on eight? Something like that. Most of the year, I haven't had a shaved head. And I remember back then, especially in last December, I made a video saying how perfectly happy I was with a shaved head. And I, I mean, I've hit, hit moments of hair happiness um, since then. I have, I mean, but now that my hair is this long, I, you, you probably saw my video yesterday about the baby bald spot blues or whatever I called it I mean I can't get over this the back of my hair I mean it could be so much worse but I don't know if you've seen that video and I don't know if I'd be able to do it here but but my hair is thinning back there so it's like even if I get this right or decent I've still got that and so I can't win except for shaving it off that always makes me the happiest but it's like the paradox is when I do that then I think, but I still could have hair, and it, it looks good. But ultimately, in all my research, most people who've watched my videos agree that I look better with a shaved head. So it's funny because will I watch this video a couple of months from now when I have a shaved head again? Well, I'll watch this video and think, see, I looked better then. I was, I was happier then, but no. And I'm speaking to, my, to the future version of myself with a shaved head. You're actually not happier this way because you're preoccupied with the with the back, how it's thinned out. Because when it's this long, it brings attention to the how the back is thinner, and then you're preoccupied with just now. Uh, whenever you're moving quickly, your hair messes up and then it gets out of place and inconsistent. So, I mean, I guess uh, if it's shorter, I, I could be happier because then it won't move around as much. There's, there's that happy medium of not having it this long, probably having about two inches, where I can still kind of move it to the side and still have it kind of messy without showing how thin I am. And that would help with the fact that it is thinner in the back. It would downplay all that. And, I'm, and I probably will transition into that before I shave it off again. But still though, hair is not making me a happier person. Am I a happy person? Absolutely I am. And I know it's, it can be hard to always understand that from watching these videos. Because in essence, I'm kind of like Stephen Colbert. I am an actor, speaking from true experience and all that's real, but ultimately I'm playing a character in front of a camera. I've admitted that before, that's not news. If you were to sit down with me and hang out with me, I'd be talking more to you like this and less about all the theatrics that naturally come with this role that I do for this channel. But ultimately, as far as, yeah, I'm a happy person, but happiness is a temporary feeling, right? And, and joy is permanent. So as far as the happiness you can, I could control, I'd be happier if I just cut my hair. So really, for my next haircut, I need to cut it shorter. Um, and then that way I can work my way to transitioning to, to shaving it off again, which is really what I want to do. I'm telling you, I mean, it was really, it was a milestone for me yesterday seeing the back of my head because I don't typically look at the back of my head but I think again it's not awful but I think my hair like this looks best in pictures but in real life it's got it's got some issues and I don't like things that could be better to not be better I want to go ahead and just make them better and I know that shaving my head is the way to make that better so having hair doesn't necessarily make you happy so even if you have more hair you still got issues unless you've got a perfect hairline and you don't have thinning then I guess you you wouldn't have those issues to worry about even then though you're still gonna go gray so it's just easier just to shave it off and, and own that and as far as if we're judging happiness level on hair I have to say having a shaved hair it makes me the happiest I mean we can revisit this conversation the next time I get a haircut and it's a little bit shorter am I am I as happy as I was when it was shaved off. I, I'm willing to explore that. But as for right now, I'm definitely happier with a shaved head than I am right now. This is Nick Shell, the internet receding hairline guy.